नमस्ते प्राइम मिनिस्टर नरेंद्र मोदी जी यस्टरडे अनाउंस्ड अ ट्वेंटी वन डे लॉकडाउन अक्रॉस द कंट्री वाइल दिस हैज सर्ड एस साई ऑफ रिलीफ टू अट ऑफ अस लॉट ऑफ पीपल लाइक यू एंड मी सिटिंग हियर इट हैज ऑल्सो सेंड अ शॉक वेव अक्रॉस द अनऑर्गेनाइज सेक्टर of course i think this is one of the best decision that any country could have taken given the fact which many countries failed to adopt at early stage for example us china even italy probably the consequences could have been reduced to a great extent if these calls were taken earlier on but fortunately for us the government has taken a tough stand against the coronavirus battle and i think the best thing as the pm said yesterday for all of us is to stay back at home and take care of ourselves and our family but is there something that we can do beyond just sitting at home i recently got a whatsapp message which i wanted to share with you there are a lot of people who are actually employed in the unorganized sector and these are the people who are going to be affected a lot the question is will you be responsible will you take the responsibility for such people many of us who have tech and tech related job find it fairly convenient and easy to exercise the choice to write to work from home and i'm sure you completely acknowledge the fact that what kind of uh, work we have and what work we do from home all of that is going to probably slowly evolve but for a lot of us this is a first time experience of working from home and we are fortunate that we are also getting paid for the work that we are doing from home the work gets easier the work gets done quick probably the advantages are so many all of us are also going to get paid for the labor that we are going to do for the next 21 days and just as you do get paid think of those who may not be able to deliver their usual work because their jobs are different if you employ people in unskilled jobs would you offer them the same courtesy that you expect from your employers i know the answer is not easy but these are not easy times either it may take a month it may take 21 days perhaps or even more for the corona virus crisis to come down the people most affected would be the ones who are in unorganized sector all of a sudden you will not need a driver because you are grounded home the house help will not show up for the work because her children are at home and her husband does not have his daily work the eatery person whom you used to go and very nicely save the pani puri will probably also not have anybody to cater to because there is no customer there is no requirement for him on the road what will happen to such kind of people laborers are likely get likely to get laid off because there is no employer for them poor children will miss their midday meal you know probably one of the best meal that they could get from the school of course the government is trying their best to ensure that proper necessary arrangements daily essentials are available for these people but do remember that a large fraction of the society is probably probably not even going to recover after 21 days it might even take them much longer period so during a period like this it is the weakest who suffer the most if they don't get their daily wage they won't have enough savings or find money or the credit to put bread on the table and god forbid if they do catch the virus they will not have the same level of care and comfort that you and i have sitting here and we are actually fortunate to have this will we survive this yes we will definitely survive this this epidemic this pandemic will get over and i'm sure that we will all come out through this very safely and positively emotionally financially socially question is will they will they be able to survive this without having to suffer collateral damages the best of humanity shines through during the worst of the times it is at this time we must all think of those people who are actually dependent on our income for our income is probably the only source for these kind of people if you continue to get paid please pay them too whether they are able to work or not work is a different question whether it is the right thing to do that is the question you need to ask and that is a very good question you need to answer to it is not about being fair or unfair 
or being loyal it's all about humanity this is the time which tests your character and how you respond to people in time of need please remember this crisis was not of their making do not punish them if they are not able to do what they are supposed to be doing in a challenging time like this it is as much difficult for them as much as it is difficult for you and i if you are able to save somebody's life they will only be grateful to you and remember anything that you do good comes back to you okay so today is the time for all of us to commit to stand up for each other and give everyone the confidence that you will be there for them during this tough time please tell your house help that you are there for her in case of any emergency any need that she or he might require please give them the assurance just as they are there for you every single day remember they are there at your house on time working for you as per their commitment so this is the time for you to take a call for them as well god bless and take care stay safe at home and in case you find this message important do share it with your friends who knows you might be able to save somebody's life and bring a daily bread on their table thank you very much